I'm Greasy Will. And I'm Jake Reed. Uh, a lot of times we get to make some really cool music in places like this East West Studio 2, which is probably one of the most famous drum rooms in the world. And the two things that we like the most is making music and talking about making music. So we decided that we would take this opportunity and turn it into a day camp for y'all to also learn what we know. I don't know what you else. Just, you just said everything. I don't, I don't, I don't know. know. All right, well then let's do it. There's going to be snacks. <laughs> there will be snacks. <laughs> August 21st, 2022. East West Studio. Studio 2. That's where we'll be. Right here. Teaching you about this stuff. How to record the drums. That's what I said. About this stuff. Yeah. Rick Rubin uh, basically camped out here for most of the 90s. Like all your favorite rock songs from the 90s were done in this room. Every Chili Peppers record with the exception of like two or three is lots of rock history in this room. But we also done some really cool like jazz sessions in here. We spent a lot of time in this room. I personally- We done, met in this room. We met in this room. They did a lot of uh, Wrecking Crew stuff in here, Wrecking right? Wrecking Crew definitely happened. Hal here. Blaine sat right here. Probably, because this is I, the drum spot. But, I don't you know. know if that's true or not, I just made that up. But Chad Smith did sit there, for sure. We will have giveaways. And snacks! S plenty of snacks to go plenty around. I'm most excited for the snacks. I, I, yeah. We, see, we're hyping the snacks up. We're gonna end up having to like, have some like, real, like a charcuterie board. And the key to a successful recording session? Snacks. Well, you just covered a lot of it. I mean, I did. You say something about recording drums is more about the drum sound, you know? And so you're gonna teach drum sounds for recording. The secret to any great drum sound is a great engineer. That's a lie. <laughs> it's actually the drums. Remember, the microphones don't make a sound. That is very true. That's why we're gonna touch both drumming from a recording uh, perspective, but also engineering from a drumming perspective. Think of it as a drum engineer ambassadorship program where we're gonna cross some boundaries and, uh, and get on both sides of the glass for this one. Yeah, it's, uh, it's camp. We're going to camp, everybody. We're gonna cover a lot of ground here. We're gonna talk about different styles. This is gonna be like real life social media. It used to be that social media was like real life, but now we're doing social media in real life. Yeah, real life social media. So you can sit here in the room with us and ask us any question that comes to mind at that moment. We are uh, also going to offer a live stream, so look into that as well. We'll be able to send you a link and link in bio. Yeah, link in bio. No, a lot of the concepts we're gonna talk about in here, you can actually apply to recording in your bedroom. Yeah, it doesn't matter whether you're working with, you know, $150,000 worth of microphones or, or $500 worth of microphones. We're going to teach you concepts that will be uh, applicable to all the different styles of recording. Should we name off a bunch of, like, just stuff? Stuff. Phase. Impedance. EQ. Dual monodynamic compression. Condenser mic. Phantom power. <laughs> Ribbon microphones. Mm. Double braced hi-hat stand. A Neumann? Sennheiser 421. Have you guys seen that Beckstein piano? We're not talking about, this isn't about pianos. <laughs> this is all, uh, this is a drum recording day camp. Three, two, one, go. Hello. And welcome to Will and Jake's drum, what are we calling it? J day drum day recording. It's a drum Hello. recording day camp. Hi. Hi. Welcome to. Hi. Welcome to Will. Gre Hi. Uh, welcome to Greasy Will. Let's start over. Hi. And welcome to Greasy, Greasy Will, Will and Jake, Jake Reed's day, day drum, drum recording drum day, recording day camp. camp. Drum recording day camp. It's great. Yeah, that's definitely what we should do. <laughs>